dogs are quiet. At the minute. At the minute. Yeah, I've had a little bit of a cry and a bit of a. Oh, help. Help. I'm stuck. And uh, I was just getting them out of the house. Yeah. So we're on our first our maiden, maiden, maiden voyage. voyage and camp. Yeah, so we're on our way to. Oh, actually, I'm going to tell you. Wareham so Forest. Solutions. Wareham Forest. Well, no, we're, not. we're on our way to Wareham Forest. Tourist Park. Ca Tourist Park, that's the one. I can think I was just about to say Caravan and Camping Club, so it was not. <coughs> two free nights away. Two free nights away. But first. They're not two free nights away. I call them complimentary nights. But first, you're going on your first exciting thing. My first before exciting we thing. There. Oh no, we've got an upgrade to the caravan that's got to happen before yeah. we get to Wareham Forest today. So, <sighs> you'll see that. Yes, you will. We're going to a place called Solar Solutions. I wasn't going to tell them. It says it all, doesn't it? So no, it doesn't say it all. I oh, know. But yeah, Solar, Solar Solutions, <coughs> it says it all. Yeah. So, a small upgrade. Yeah. Which will make a, a massive difference. I think. Yeah. Well, we'll see, won't we? Yep. Anyway, I'm going to concentrate on the driving and Kim will do what Kim does, which is Nothing. fairly not a lot, not a lot, and uh, possibly just pick you up when we get to the campsite. Yeah. See you in a bit. <gasps> oh, excuse me. She's a freaking uh, animal. Oh. Oh, motor home coming. So. That's where we are, right now. We're in Solar Solutions, or at Solar Solutions. Just pop you back on the dash. We're having self-leveling fitted, or will be. Yeah. I'm hoping. <laughs> Breakfast, boys have had theirs. Kim's been to Tesco, used up her club card points. I've still got some left. Mm. Might go and shop again. The hell? So I've got bacon, sausage, egg, triple. I've got chicken and stuffing. I've got seven pound fifty to work left. Oh. Where are the toilets? Upstairs, to the side of the cafe. Mm. So we've got the escalator. Turn that go all the way down to the cafe. It's in the right hand corner. So yes, you'll notice that the caravan's been dropped off. We don't have it. Being worked on. Having the additions. The new babies. The addition. I've left Kim. In 100 mood. So I've finished. Finished with Kim, that's it. I've left her. No. No, she's um she's in the car with me, Shell. Her daughter. I am going to go to in pick up the caravan. Yeah, I've got the boys in the boot. Well, I got the wobble box back. Exciting, isn't it? However, where we are, <coughs> there is zero 4G. 3G was very sketchy. And I went to pay for said upgrade, and guess what? Nope. Couldn't use my phone to pay. Kim's back with Misha, and uh, we had to make the payment over the phone with Kim's card number because I haven't got my wallet with me. And there I was thinking that you don't need a signal for Apple Pay, but you do. You definitely do. On my way to Wareham Forest Tourist Park now. See, I'm about, I don't know, 15 minutes away. And you'll see when we get there. I've arrived. Nearly didn't arrive. Got a car coming up to the campsite, pull into a little laid-by bit on the left-hand side, spin around and just drive out in front of me. Morning. And then just around this side, Sorry. have a little kick. It's going to look a bit dark then, it's probably because I've got the window, I'll shut the, let me shut the blind. Okay. 
<laughs> oh, first night. It was lovely. Morning, 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 morning. Yeah, first night. Lovely. Slept like a baby. Wet the bed. <laughs> the boys. They had a good night. Kim had a good night's sleep. And they do, they, they do, they can't keep them off the bed, they're beagles, and they go under the bed, under the covers. Um, and where we had the porto, um, you always fighting for covers and space. This bed is mahusive. Um, it's, it's me, Kim, and the beagles, and you hardly know, you hardly notice it. Let's just pause that. Just watching a bit of caravan tastic. So there's Kim look. And she's just uh, making the bed. Again, again, again. Because it got unmade yesterday by Conquer twice. Yeah. <coughs> Which is funny. Um and here's my new toilet. You've all been waiting to see what my new toy is. Hey, leave it. Leave it. Leave. I'm telling Con oh, to leave it. Look. It's a new coffee machine. Oh dear. Oh, dear. oh ugly. Come on, move. Move your butt. Come on, stop getting in behind me. There we go. Good boy. This one fits in the cupboard, doesn't it? Yeah, it, uh, it did take up a lot of room. It's much bigger than that. But this one, just a little bit smaller, that is. For about a third less in size. Um, yeah, so it's. It's really. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, she's so happy. I mean, so happy, we got. We? Yeah, we've got. We've, we we appear to have more space than the Porto. We didn't think we would have. No. But I think we have. Admittedly, we may not have put as much back in, but I don't think Kim's really. I didn't know. She hasn't gone. None of it's going in. She wanted all of it in, but there was bits that we didn't put in, but. Not massive amount. No. A bit waffle now, but see, I mean, we got my teddy bears. Don't, I'm not expecting to get a bloody Bailey bear. Didn't get one last time. No. Kim's. Yesterday, when I was setting up, oh, I felt like a complete novice, and that's only because, only because, everything's in a different place. Everything's in a different place. Um, we'll pause here. Everything yeah, sorry, a little bit of an interlude with the phone call. Set it up yesterday. Everything's in a different place. The chemicals are in a different place. Um, my water barrel handle was in the wrong, a different place, because I normally keep that in the gas locker. That's in a locker under the front here. Um, the chemicals are under the front here, because it's just a locker that goes all the way through. We never had that before. So you've got a massive locker. Exciting. That still isn't full by any shape or form, but, no, but I think it's um it's just got everything in a different place. So it took it didn't take me forever. I thought it was pretty quick. Yeah, I thought it was pretty quick. I mean we were just setting up a caravan, not a caravan and an awning. And the um, fact that we didn't have to you had your new gadget outside. Yeah my coffee. Coffee yeah. machine. It didn't didn't take long at all. And considering you just sat in here and did nothing and chatted with Shelley well, and I just got on but maybe that's why it felt so quick because I just got on out with my stuff outside. Yeah and I'd um I'd, it's easier for some reason I don't know why it just seems easier to come out and load the van up with the clothes the day before and do the food the day before that's pretty much what you do anyway yeah I know but sometimes it seems to take forever doesn't it five ever five ever the bedding's not done but I'd made the bedding and everything yeah all I had to do was put my flap down in here basically yeah she didn't have a flap down I had to remind her have you put your flap down yeah oh no I didn't even know where my flap was it's in a different place it's over this side yeah, I think you might be able to reach it from the from the locker outside now. Oh. So really? that becomes a freaking blue job, doesn't it? Oh, I don't mind. No, I'll check if that. If I can, I'll, I'll check that. If I can reach it outside, I'll do it outside because then at least I know. Yeah. But it, but it was easier to get to than on the border. Yeah. See, apart from that, it was a lot of me to and fro and getting used to where all the bits were. But yeah, it's a. It's a really easy. Yeah. I, really easy. It's one and of the less quick. stressful. I mean, no doubt when we've got an awning and things like that. It'll be really stressful for her because when we've got the awning, which is a blue job, which is outside, well, it'll be really two, stressful for me because what'll minutes. happen is I'll be putting the awning up, she'll come out and sit in this chair with a beer and go, well, I've done my bits. 
<laughs> As you always do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Right. Um, anything else you want to say about yesterday? Coming here? Everything all right? Yeah, everything was fine, wasn't it? You had a little wait till you got your gadget done. The coffee machine. Yeah. Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> and then. Yeah. No, it's all straightforward. I I like it here anyway. Like this campsite, like South Lichit. I like this pitch. Yes, I like this pitch. This pitch, this pitch at Wareham Forest is pitch number 30. Well, I shouldn't really tell you because I don't want anybody else to have it now. But you can, I mean, anybody who's parked at Wareham Forest, you, you've not got the massive amount of room for reversing and stuff like that. But pitch 30, you drive in from this road here, and all I did was I then reversed the van and uh, I drove into that bit there, and then I reversed the van from that large space into our pitch. And it was so much easier. It was a longer reverse, but but easier to do. Right opposite the toilet and shower. Yeah, we're near the toilets and showers, which is over there. Over there, see? Um, I was going to say, with this place as well, worth pointing out, you don't have to pay for your awning here. They don't charge you for an awning. No, your pitch is your pitch. You do what you want with it. Yeah. And I don't think any of them are any fully serviced too. I don't think so. I don't think so, I don't know. But you can have tents, caravans, motorhomes. Tents, caravan, motorhomes. And a tent, there's plenty of pitches out there. I took the doggies for a walk yesterday. And there's loads of what I would count as a, as a normal caravan or motorhome pitch we'll with tents on. Just Probably because uh, the ground's been so boggy as well. Probably, or maybe their tent field isn't open. There is a tent in a tent field. I think Kim's massive knowledge of this site so far is the toilet block again. <laughs> and she didn't use that very many times yesterday. No. Once. I had to try out my new toilet. Which, do you feel like it's higher off the floor? No. Taller? Kim, say, Kim thinks our toilet's higher off the floor. Yeah, I do. I, feel like it is. I just thought it was a standard height toilet that that would make. There's definitely not a plinth underneath it. No. Who knows? Right, we'll see them in a bezel, won't we? Yeah, we'll see you in a shizzle. Okay, that's great. And little hey-ho, um, at night time there, we're going to have a little light on. Um, and that little night light. So we've got it's not pausing. I can't pause it. One of these. Yeah. It's quite cute. Um, trying to pause. pause. There. Well, I am pressing the pause button, but she's not pausing. Just thought we'd show you this, because the boys are very, very settled, as we told you. It is actually unbelievable how settled they are when we're away in the caravan, isn't it? Yeah, they're totally different. Just, uh, just totally, two totally different dogs. But at home, pretty much always on the go. And they just want to keep going outside all the time. When we're in the caravan, they don't care. They just they want to go out they're when they want to go out, and that's it. Otherwise, they're happy to be in here. Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, there you go. It's, um, it's really nice to be away and the boys it makes us, having them like that as well makes us relax more I feel doesn't it yeah oh yeah don't it ever yeah you like on a cat on a hot tin roof when they're at home because you just don't know whether they want to can't sit down and relax because they no. just want to go out want to come in want to go out want to go out want to go out and... not in the van we need another week away we need another week away we need a week away that'll be coming pate and crackers Mm. I just dropped that out of my mouth. Did you? Mm. People will see you eating. They see your mm -hmm. eating habits. Oh, blimey, my she third like head. A... <laughs> I wasn't going to say that. Oh, you actually did it on the microphone. Some Austrian beaver cheese. <clears throat> I don't know if I need it all yet. Just eat it all. That's good. Pate you not had any of the blue cheese? Nope. Not having any? Nope. I'm just eating what you're not eating. I love this. It'd be nice with a bit of pork. If only you had some. Yeah. If only. What does everybody else eat for lunch in their vans? I bet they have. I don't know. Are oh, you asking? Mm. What are you all eating? In your vans? This Kim is not the practical. These aren't. The practical thing for pate, these rovita well, things. I think they are. 
Reckon. Well, I think they're perfect. Personally, I'd rather have green crackers, but I think these are quite nice. That's the second time it's nearly slipped down my mouth. Is it? Mm. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> that was very nice. Nice little lunch, wasn't it? Right, EMP, unlovely. So I've lifted my legs. Because you can't have your legs up, as in corner cities. Roll up. My control unit is in here. I'm going to print the cover on this so we can't accidentally turn it on or off. And in a minute, I'm going to retract the legs, which is that button. So I'm going to turn the system on. Um, what happened, and I'm glad it happened actually, because I was a bit unsure about this. If the nose is still level, it won't let you retract the legs unless you're in an emergency, but I'm not in an emergency. So, one of these lights next to the power light went bright red, which is really good for me because I'm glad about that. So I can't accidentally raise the legs because if the caravan's level, it won't let you do it kind of a safety feature that they warned me about but they didn't tell me about it being a good safety feature that I think. But there you go, my EMP unlevelled in seconds. Looking forward to using it again when we get home. I'm on a bit more of, a, of an incline there. Hopefully it will level up there. So yeah, nose down, it'll allow you to do it. Nose up, won't let you retract the legs. See you in a bit. Cheers, happy. Happy new caravan um, day. The next, you've got more than me. I pulled well, you it. You pulled it. Oh no. Well, yeah. Happy caravan well, second day. Happy holidays. Enjoy what you do, what you got, wherever you go, however you do it. So, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. Drop us a uh, a comment. Yeah. Have you been there before? Well, uh, if you want to know if we can help you with anything else. Yeah. Um, so yeah. Thanks for watching. Thanks for coming. We'll see you next one. Cheerio. Bye. Bye.